west side, worldwide, ride out. Now, I ain't got no kids yet, but this right here's for practice. I hate to get the seats in the bins wet. Hey guys, it's me, Mella C, and welcome back to my channel. On this episode of Mella Makes, I'm obviously in a different location. That is because I am back home for fall break. On today's episode, we'll be making homemade cinnamon roll bites. This TikTok video was posted out by the user pigout underscore NYC. The video currently has 1.5 million views and 174K light. This recipe could be used for breakfast, dessert, or just as a snack. So it's very versatile. So yeah, and it doesn't require a lot of ingredients. So let's get started. All right, you guys, so these are the homemade cinnamon bites. They're pretty simple to make. I was having a little bit of trouble making the sauce, but I just added a little bit more powdered sugar and that helped thicken it up and get rid of some of the clumps that we saw earlier. So let's try it. It's actually good. Oh, It's really good. And because we put the cream cheese frosting, or the cream cheese in the frosting, it's like a cream cheese frosting. You guys, I think this is another success. On a scale of one to five, one being the absolute worst and five being fantastic, I would give this dish a four. I only docked it one point because in the video it says a splash of milk. Not really sure how much milk that is. I kind of eyeballed it and it worked out okay. Um, but that also may be the reason why my um, icing came out a little clumpy at first and another reason why I had to add the powdered sugar. So I feel like that's fair enough to dock the recipe one point. So four out of five is my overall rating. All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching this episode of Mila Makes. If you have any TikTok recipes that you want me to try in the future, make sure you comment them down below. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up and I will cook for you guys later. Bye. Um, okay. Hi, my name is Layla and I am. What should I say? Oh, okay.